So I'm looking to find the poly count of my objects in Blender. How do I do it? Well, it's pretty simple and I'm going to walk you through it. First, you need to go up top to your overlays menu in the right corner, and then you hit that arrow button to expand the options and then click the check mark for statistics. Then you'll see this little, uh, these numbers pop up on the left hand corner and that's good. But as you can see, if I select each object, it doesn't really change. So this is not necessarily what I want. I want the counts specifically. So in order, in order to do that, I need to go into edit mode. So I'm going to either drop down and click edit mode or just click tab on my keyboard to get into that mode. And then to select all, and I am in face mode. I think that's probably the best, but probably works in all different modes. Um, you can select A and, yep, the numbers don't change. So if I select A, I have everything on this object selected and you can see the counts have updated accordingly. So these are the numbers for this specific object and faces represents polys. So if I'm looking for my poly count, it's essentially the face count. And um, I only have quads here, even though it says triangles, that's just breaking it down if it were triangles, but I do have quads. So my quad count would also be the number that the face count is. So that's good. If I go back into object mode by hitting tab, I can select the other part here and then tab again, and then A on my keyboard again, and I can get the count for this specific object. And I've got all my numbers listed here on the side. And as you can see, these numbers are lower because they're just lower, there's a lower poly count on this object, which makes sense because this one has an inside. So it's more space for more polys. So what if I wanna uh, calculate both? Well, I'm gonna tab into object mode, shift select both objects, tab again to get into edit mode, select A if everything is not selected, and there you go, you've got all of it added together on the side here. So that's it, I hope this helped. When you wanna turn it off, you can just go back into uh, your display options and undo statistics, and that's it. Thank you guys.